Hey, Kathleen here. I am reviewing the Blendtec four side pitcher. This is not the large one. This is not the wild side pitcher. That's a little bit bigger. This is the four side pitcher or, or jar. I absolutely love it. And I'm going to tell you a little story. We've had this for about eight to 10 years. And this is the original pitcher or, or jar that I've had. I've put it on the bottom of the dishwasher. I have not had any problems with that. They do not say that. They say top rack or wash you know, by hand using the, their technique, which is putting a little bit of soap, more, a little bit of warm water, and then putting the top on it and blending, and then it kind of swishes out the sides, and it absolutely works fine. Totally do that a lot. But occasionally I would throw it on the bottom of my dishwasher. It does not say that, it says top. So anyway, recently I noticed that this was not spinning well. The blade was not spinning well. And this blade is, I don't know what the right word is, but it's embedded um, in here by the factory. So it's not a blade that you can unscrew and replace. So when I try to unscrew it, it looks like it's turning, right? But if I hold the blade, I can turn this and the blade doesn't move. So that's not supposed to happen. So I knew I needed a new pitcher, did some research, got the new pitcher, worked absolutely fine on my old base. I have blended in my blend tech over 6,000 times. Whether I've made soups, I've made smoothies, I've made fruit fruit drinks, I've made a lot of different things. So over 6,000 times, so I decided to keep my original base just by the pitcher instead of buying a whole new blend tech, which I may do at some point if I need to. And, but just getting the pitcher has solved my problem. Now, a couple things about the lid. This new pitcher is a little different. This pitcher, I can just slide my finger up and there's no lip. When I slide my finger up here, there's a lip here. Okay, and that's because of the way they've now arranged the lid. The old lid fit on here and it was fine if you didn't mess it up. And of course, occasionally I did. Occasionally I didn't push it down all the way, all sides. And I had did have, you know, it pop off um, a couple times, but that was user error. They've resolved that. They now have the lid so that you just, it's so much easier. And they actually made this a little smaller, venting. Um, you can actually put things in this way, but it's also for venting. So I absolutely love this. 